Hello, hello, and welcome to Brainplay TV. I'm your host, JC. Are you ready to have some fun and learn something too? Me too. Don't go away, cause it's time to play. Welcome back to Brainplay TV with your host, JC. And in this video, we're going to look at Emma's Magnet Lab on the Papumba app. In this little game, we're going to learn some knowledge about the physical world, and we're going to use some critical thinking skills. I hope you're getting some value out of our videos, and I hope you'll like this video and subscribe to our channel for more videos on Brainplay TV. Let's jump right into Emma's Magnet Lab. Emma and Coco welcome you to their lab. Help them predict whether or not the objects will be attracted by the magnet. Hmm. So we have to guess whether objects are going to... Touch the option you think is correct to confirm it. Whether objects are going to be attracted to the magnet or not. What do you think? Will a coconut be attracted to a magnet or not? Hmm. You don't think so? Okay. You're very good at science. You were right. Awesome. Metal toy car. Ooh, a metal toy car. A natural magnet is a mineral with magnetic properties. Amazing, right? Hmm. A mineral with magnetic properties. And magnets tend to attract metals. So do you think a metal toy car will go to the magnet? Or do you think it will fall down? Oh, well, you think it'll go to the magnet? Okay, let's find out. Isaac Newton would be very happy for you. Yay! Great job. Shoe. A shoe. What do you think the shoe is? A magnet is? is any object that produces a magnetic field and attracts a certain kind of metals. Amazing, don't you think? Hmm, magnets attract metals. What do you think the shoe is made of? Is it made of metal, yes or no? No? So it probably will fall down? Okay. Isaac Newton would be very happy for you. You were right. Great job. Plastic comb. A plastic comb. Comb. A natural magnet is a mineral with magnetic properties. Amazing, right? Do you think a plastic comb will go to the magnet or fall down? Hmm. Oh, somebody said it'll go to the magnet. Oops. Oops. Uh-oh. Nope. A comb is not made of metal. Plastic bottle. A plastic bottle. It's very interesting to learn about the Earth's phenomena, don't you think? Do you think a plastic bottle will go to the magnet or fall down? Hmm, it's not made of metal, so it'll go down. Okay. Isaac Newton would be very happy for you. You got it. Good job. Cork. Cork. Do you think a cork will go it's to the magnet? It's interesting to learn about the Earth's phenomena, don't you think? I'll give you a hint. There's no metal in a cork. Stephen Hawking would be overcome with emotion. Good job. Potato. Potato. Mm. Hey, I'm having a great time learning about magnetism with you. Do you think a potato will go to the magnet or not? Is a potato made out of metal? No, it's not made out of metal. You know a lot about science. Good job. Plastic comb. Plastic comb. Mm, we've seen this one before. A magnet is any object that produces a magnetic field. So will field this one go up a certain kind or of down? Amazing, don't you think? Up or down? Down. Charles Darwin would be proud of you. You got it right this time. Woohoo! <laughs> Yay! Golf ball. A golf ball. Will that go to the magnet or will a it magnet fall down? Is any object that produces a magnetic field and attracts a mm. certain kind of metals. Amazing, don't you think? You think a golf ball will go up? You think there's metal in a golf ball? Oh, no? Okay, no. 
Galileo Galilei would be very happy for you. Good job. You're right. It's not made of metal. Feather. Will a feather go up or down? Hey, I'm having a great time learning about magnetism with you. Stephen Hawking down. would be overcome with emotion. It went down. Good job. Steel bucket. Ooh, a steel bucket. A magnet is any object that produces a magnetic field and attracts a certain kind of metals. Amazing. Certain kinds of metals. Do you think steel is a metal that will go to a magnet? You do? Hmm. Charles Darwin would be proud You're of you. You're right. You were right. Steel does go to a magnet. Plastic comb. Hmm. No. We you know must a comb be a scientist. Won't. A saw. Does it look like a saw has metal hey, on it? I'm having a great time learning about magnetism with you. Yes? You are very good at science. You were right. You are great at this. Wooden spoon. A wooden spoon. Hey, I'm having a great time learning Is about magnetism with you. Is a wooden spoon made of wood or metal? Wood. You're right. You must be a scientist. Glass lab flask. A glass flask. It's very interesting to learn about the Earth's phenomena, don't you think? Will that go up or down? Hmm, down. It's not made of you metal. You are very good at science. Great job. <laughs> Woohoo! Carrot. Carrot. Will a carrot go to the magnet? Will it go up it's or down? It's very interesting to learn about the Earth's phenomena, don't you think? Are carrots made of metal? No. Stephen Hawking would be overcome with emotion. Hmm. Plastic brick. Plastic bricks. Hmm. It's very interesting to learn about the Earth's phenomena. Are plastic blocks made of metal or are they made of plastic? They're made of plastic, so they're not going to go to the magnet. They're going to go down. Isaac Newton would be very happy for you. Lock. What about a lock? Is a lock made of metal? It's very interesting to learn about the Earth's phenomena. It Don't is? You think? I think you're right. If you said it's made of metal, I think you're right. You know a lot about science. Good job. That was excellent. Marbles. Will marbles go up or down? Did you know that you can do experiments with your refrigerator magnets? I'll give you a hint. Marbles are made of glass, not metal. Hmm. Charles Darwin would be proud of you. Good job. Stone. A stone, a rock. Is a rock Did made of metal? Did you know that you can do experiments with your refrigerator magnets? Hmm. Some rocks have metal in them, but this one... You are very good at science. No. Screwdriver. Ooh, a screwdriver. Is that metal? A natural magnet is a mineral with magnetic properties. I think it is. Amazing, right? Charles Darwin would be proud of you. Great job. You're getting good at this. Teapot. Ooh, a teapot. Is that metal? A magnet is any object that produces a magnetic field mm. and attracts a certain kind. Charles Darwin would be proud of you. Good job. That was excellent. You did it. <laughs> Ooh, we might get a prize soon. Lock. A lock. We know the lock is going to go up. Like it's Albert made of Einstein. metal. It's made of metal. Small horseshoe magnet. Ooh, will a magnet go up or down? Did you know that you can do experiments with your refrigerator magnets? You think it'll go up? You're a genius, like Albert Einstein. You were right. It did go up. Will an apple go up or down? A natural magnet is a mineral. Stephen Hawking down. would be overcome with There's no with metal emotion. in an apple. Metal sieve. A metal sieve. Hmm. A magnet is any object that produces a magnetic field. Some people call that a strainer a or a colander. Amazing, don't you think? Some people call it a sieve or a sieve. And it's made of metal, so it's going to go to the magnet. Good job. You know a lot about science. Awesome! 
teapot. There's a teapot. Is it it's going to go up or down? It's very interesting to learn about the Earth's phenomena, don't you think? Stephen Hawking would be overcome with emotion. It went up. Awesome possum. Iron dumbbell. Iron dumbbells. You think those it's will go to a magnet? It's very interesting to learn about the Earth's phenomena, don't you think? Charles Darwin would be proud of you. You are the bee's knees. Corn. Corn. Hmm. Hey, I'm having a great time learning about magnetism with you. Is corn metal? No. If you said no, you were right. You know a lot about science. <laughs> Woohoo! Look at that. Only one away from the prize. Bottle cap. Ooh, a bottle cap. Is a bottle cap made of hey, metal? Hey, I'm having a great time learning about magnetism with you. It is. You are very good at science. You're right. Seashell. A seashell. Is that made of metal? It's very interesting to oh. learn about the Earth's phenomena. You are very good at science. Roof, roof, says the doggy. Emma says, excellent Beach job. Ball. Beach ball. No. You must be a scientist. Metal ruler. A metal ruler. Will a metal ruler a natural ruler magnet is a mineral with go magnetic to the magnet? properties. Amazing, right? Will it go up? Yes. You're a genius, like Albert Einstein. Incredible. Marbles. Marbles. Will those go up or down? A magnet is any object that produces a magnetic... Down. Galileo Galilei would be very happy for you. Bell pepper. A bell pepper. Yum. Will that go to the magnet it's or no? It's very interesting to learn about the Earth's phenomena, don't you think? Is a bell pepper made of metal? No, it's not. It'll go down. You're a genius like Albert Einstein. If you said down, you did an awesome job. Stone. A stone or a rock. Will that go up a or down? A natural magnet is a mineral with magnetic prop. Thomas Edison would be proud of you. You were right. It went down. Woohoo! <laughs> Ooh, yay. We get a box. We get a box. What's in the prize? We want to know what the prize is. What's in the box? Oh. A hammer and nails. <laughs> A hammer and nails. <laughs> That's funny. Potato. Well, that was Emma's Magnet Lab here on the Papumba app. Thank you for watching this video on BrainPlay TV with your host, JC. I hope you like this video and you subscribe to our channel for more great videos. And we'll see you again soon. Bye-bye. Bye. -bye. Bye.